Their grief is unimaginable. The sister and mother of the bride killed by an alleged drunk driver are speaking out exclusively to Inside Edition. This isn't real, right? Like, I'm going to wake up from this and Sammy's going to come walking through the door and be like, gotcha. Samantha and Eric Hutchinson exchanged vows at their dream wedding on a picturesque beach in South Carolina. I've never seen two people love each other like they did. Following the reception, they bid goodbye to their guests, including her sister, Mandy Jenkins, and mom, Lisa Miller, with whom she had shared a special dance. But she didn't want the night to end. She as, wanted the night to last forever. It was, it was perfect. Then, disaster. As the bride and groom set off with two relatives on a golf cart, police say they were rear-ended by a car traveling 65 miles an hour. Can you take us back to the moment that you heard? All of a sudden, within five, five, ten minutes, not even, we started hearing a lot of sirens, fire trucks, police, everything. And I just said something happened to Sam. I knew something happened to Sam. We... We're just running down the street towards the scene and all the lights and just screaming Sam's name over and over again. It was, when you think of it, it's really like a really bad movie. Sam was killed instantly, still in her wedding gown. I saw my mom on the phone and she was screaming. It just fell to her knees and no, it just angry punching like the air. Like. When we spoke to Mandy and Lisa, they were on their way to the hospital to visit Eric, who's recovering from surgery. The family has set up a GoFundMe to cover burial costs and medical bills. We're also learning more about the suspect, 25-year-old Jamie Komorowski, who told cops she had been drinking beer and tequila. Several of her Instagram photos show her as a party girl with what appears to be a drink in her hand. One year for Halloween, she dressed up with Bud Light beer logos. Sam's mom told us that in her opinion, the crash was no accident. She murdered my daughter. Oh, no! Now, after helping Samantha plan the happiest day of her life, her family is left planning her funeral. Do you guys remember the last thing you said to Sam? We always said, I love you more. 